Hello there, welcome back to the De Havilland Aircraft Museum. I'm Alistair, the curator. Now this one is a special request from Steve Randall in California. He's an Airbus pilot, but he loves chipmunks. And he's not a chipmunk, but he flies himself, so that's great. Thanks, Steve. Thanks for calling in about that one. I uh, hope you enjoy flying your chipmunk. Um, they're nice little aeroplanes, these chipmunks. De Havilland, Canada, DHC-1 chipmunk. De Havilland had a subsidiary company in Canada. Uh, right the way through the war. And after the war, uh, the Havilland of Canada started designing and building their own aircraft, their own series of planes. And the first one they built was the Chipmunk. Uh, and it was the replacement for the Tiger Moth the trainer. It's a two seat basic training aircraft for the Royal Air Force and was used widely across the world for all sorts of other air forces too. Uh, twin seater, um, the pupil would sit in the front and the instructor would sit in the back. Um, and you've got a uh, single engine. It's one of those gypsy engines, it's the gypsy major engine. I'm, I'm just going to lift the cowl and have a look. There you go, that's it. Put that there. Um, it's the classic Javelin gypsy engine with the four cylinders, the inverted cylinders, uh, with the crankshaft at the top. Uh, there's the carburetor at the bottom there, of course, um, and um, oil tank and so forth. Uh, driving the single twin bladed airscrew. Uh, so a lovely, neat little aeroplane. Um, this one was actually built at Chester. It was built at the Chester factory in 1952. We got hold of it in 1974. It was one of our earliest acquisitions, in actual fact, when we were just starting to expand as a, mu as a museum. It's been restored by the museum. Uh, a lot of it, some of it's metal. Um, the fuselage is metal, the front of the wings is metal, but the rear of the wings is still the same um, fabric coating, dome fabric coating that we used on the earlier biplanes. So it's, it's really a, a throwback to the early days. Um, it's in nice condition. This particular one was used by the Birmingham University Air Squadron. Uh, University Air Squadron is, is, a, is an RAF squadron basically attached to a particular university uh, and it's where sponsored students within the university are, are able to learn how to fly, get dual, dual control instruction and, and, and hopefully get their pilot's qualifications possibly before uh, joining the Royal Air Force. So no de Havilland Museum could ever be complete without what we call the chippy. So this is our chippy, our de Havilland Canada one chipmunk, um, especially for Steve Randall in California. Thanks very much, Steve. Um, keep them coming in, keep the requests coming in. Stay tuned, stay well, keep in touch. Thanks a lot.